Good morning and welcome back to Bristol Daily Homes. Ryan here. So we got four homes on the market over the weekend. First of which is uh, 11901 Bitten Lake Road. This is in the Pembroke section of Victory Lakes. It's a town home, three bedrooms, three and a half baths, 2,224 square feet total, 1,680 square feet above grade with a finished basement for 335000 We'll go through the pictures here. Vinyl siding, as you can see from the outside. Nice open floor plan, hardwood floors on the main level. Here's the kitchen with granite. Lots of cabinet space and counter space as well. You can see you can pull up some bar stools up underneath that center island. Um, stainless steel appliances. Huge granite slab there for the island. Deck off the back. Master bedroom. Spare bedrooms and bathrooms. And here's the rec room downstairs in the basement area, which is finished off with the gas fireplace as well. And there's the backyard. It's not fenced in, but it does have a deck. Uh, nice because you are an in unit. Um, 335000 seems to be price right in line with where majority of these townhomes have been selling anywhere from, you know, 320 to 340 seems to be the sweet spot uh, for the townhomes over there. It's built in 2009. Uh, this one looks good. Um, definitely one to consider, especially since. Um, there's some ones in Braemar that are actually pricing up to 315, 320, a little bit older, but built in like 2003 and 2004. I think this is a good price on this. 11747 Alexander Hayes Road, in New Bristow Village. 0.144 of the acreage, smaller lot on this. Four bedrooms, three and a half baths for 499,000. 4,336 square feet total, with 3,336 finished above grade. We've got a. It's like obviously you can see the detached garage on the back side of this house. There's no pictures to go off of, so we'll just go um, you know, based on what the comments are. Um, looks like it has granite kitchen, uh, countertops, tile backsplash, five burner gas cooktop. Um, it does have a patio that's off the back. And a media room, it looks like downstairs probably in the basement. Um, so I think that the price point, I haven't seen any pictures, but I think the price point on this one's pretty solid for the square footage that you're getting. Remember, majority of the lots in New Bristol Village are small and narrow because the garage is on the back side of the house, so it eats up a lot of space, so they go deep, but they're not very wide. Um, and some people don't like coming into the garage on the back side of the home. So it's just some things to consider, but I think that the price point is uh, a very good price on this one. 9171 Ribbon Falls Loop in Pembroke section of Victory Lakes, two-car garage, 340,000, three bedrooms, two full baths, two half baths, 1,960 total square feet. Um, this is another end unit, and it's in the popular Victory Lakes neighborhood. Fenced-in backyard with a fence as well, or with a deck as well. Sorry, not a fence as well. Um, we've got hardwood floors on the main level, stainless steel appliances, some interesting view of the kitchen. Looks like somebody was like on the floor taking these pictures. Um, a lot of them are kind of chopped off. Not probably a very good representation. I feel like the house would show a lot better in person on this one. Nice to have a two-car garage here. Um, 340,000. This is, like I said, right in that range for this square footage of between 320 and 340. Um, and I think that it's definitely worth looking at. Um, nice end unit with two-car two -car garage there. 12647 Tide View Courts and Lanier Farms. 464,990. It's 2,980 total square feet with 2,200 square feet above grade. This was built in 2011. Four bedrooms, three and a half baths. Um, you know, a relatively young home here, and I think that there's, you know, obviously some room to finish off more of the basement to add even more square footage. Brick and vinyl siding front, two-car garage. The lot is 0.273, so a little over a quarter acre lot. Hardwood floors in the interior there. Nice open floor plan. Here's the center island with granite countertops. Um, some cherry cabinetry, stainless steel appliances, double wall oven. The master bedroom, nice, nice ceramic tile in there. Walk in closet. I think the big thing on this one is that your square footage uh, above grade is only 2275, so it's not that large, but then again, um, you know, it's a relatively new home, so I think that the, you know, we blend those two together, and I think that the price point um, is, is right where it probably should be, maybe just a touch, just a touch high, but not much. Um, and I think that it will move relatively quick in this subdivision. So that's all we got for today, guys. If you'd like to schedule showings for any of these homes, give us a call. 
703-596-0011. If you have any questions regarding any of the communities, the new home communities, uh, such as Stillhaven um, or Avondale, we'd be glad to answer any questions you may have. We, want to take, we can take you off for a tour of the different communities and get you um, used to what amenities um, they have, as well as what the surrounding um, shopping centers and, 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 and pools and rec centers, anything that you may need to know, um, we'd be glad to help you out. 703-596-0011, or as always, you can contact us through the website, bristowdailyhomes.com. Enjoy your Monday, guys. We'll be back with you tomorrow.